<clears throat> I've got several videos of of burn stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay, first of all, your name? I'm Scott Berlin, B-U-R-L-I-N, Assistant Fire Marshal, Montgomery County. Okay, tell me the situation you've got with these Molotov cocktails. On uh, the evening before Thanksgiving, we arrested six juveniles, six teenagers in the woodlands. Uh, they were in possession of two Molotov cocktails, which is a prohibited weapon, a third-degree felony. Uh, an alert Montgomery County Deputy Sheriff on patrol uh, caught the six teenagers at David Elementary School uh, near Shadow Bend Park. Um, uh, so the, the teenagers were caught before they had a chance to light the Molotovs and, uh, and throw them. Uh, Molotov cocktails are extremely dangerous. One pint of gasoline is equivalent of approximately one stick of dynamite. So these kids could have been seriously injured or killed um, had they lit these devices and thrown them. All six have been charged and uh, the case is under review by the district attorney's office at this time. Okay, now what about, you've got other cases pending right now in Montgomery County over the same type, of, not related to this, but other cases of multiple cocktails? Right, we do have um, other cases uh, that are ongoing, other investigations ongoing uh, as we speak involving Molotov cocktails. We do not believe they're related. Um, and some, some, of the, some of the Molotovs were ignited, some were not. Again, those are ongoing criminal investigations. Okay. What about, I mean, at this time of year, you've got kids with sparkler bombs, kids with fireworks, explosive devices. Yeah, fireworks always seems to bring out the fascination in everybody. So people typically uh, they love fireworks, they love to shoot them off. But where we get in trouble is where, uh, when kids uh, attempt to build bigger firecrackers. Uh, that is against the law. Uh, typically every year we have sparkler bombs that are built. Again, these are all felony offenses. Uh, extremely dangerous. A sparkler bomb itself could, could uh, blow your hand off or take your eye out. Uh, Molotov cocktails are extremely dangerous. Any type of uh, improvised explosive device that is built is a felony offense uh, in the state of Texas. Um, and we seem to have had uh, several a year uh, recently uh, cases where kids are building devices. Uh, we've had some incidences where there have been some injuries, some serious injuries. Um, so we would just encourage parents to uh, uh, be very diligent and uh, supervise their kids. Is it just, I mean, is it just kids bored, nothing to do, or something, hey, this is neat, let's try something different, or what? You well, know, I, I think it's kids... Uh, being bored and just experimenting with uh, the devices and what they don't realize is, is first off it is a felony offense but more importantly it is extremely dangerous anytime you build any type of explosive device uh, it could injure or maim, put out an eye even kill so uh, we just encourage uh, parents to supervise their children very closely during firework season and throughout the year okay what about the house in Oak Ridge now we had a fire recently in Oak Ridge um, that was uh, determined to be an arson fire. Um, and the Oak Ridge Police Department, along with the County Fire Marshal's Office, is investigating uh, that incident and several other incidences that have occurred in Oak Ridge over the last 18 months. Um, these several incidences may or may not be connected. Again, that is an ongoing investigation. Molotovs on that one also? Uh, possibly one Molotov cocktail.